Hi, I'm Asma from ANSYS, and I'm here to share with you ANSYS Digital Twin 2024 R2 release features and key highlights. Are you ready? Let's start with an exciting news. ANSYS introduces ANSYS Twin AI, the new addition to our ANSYS Digital Twin offering. This new product combines physics accuracy with data-driven insights to help our users get the best of their digital twins. Now, let us deep dive into 2024 R2 release highlights and start with hybrid analytics features. This new release comes with a new ANSYS Twin AI GUI styling under the guideline of ANSYS design language. Some of the improvements in the user interface styling includes global dark mode support, ADL color system, topography, and desktop application layout. Parameters calibration workflow has been improved with the possibility to interpolate both input and outputs training data and get more accurate results. Reduced order models in ANSYS Twin AI. All the ROM block front ends are now available in ANSYS Twin AI. ROM blocks include response surface, singular value decomposition, linear time invariant, linear parameter variant, Gaussian process, and dynamic ROM. This feature allows our users to create ROMs as FMUs and TB ROMs in a single environment. This release brings new PyTwin APIs to evaluate reduced order model results. Users will gain more flexibility for 3D result visualization, including scene, colors, legends definition, as well as detailed visualization based on 3D meshes. Second release highlight, automation speed and accuracy for reduced order models creation. Let's deep dive into this one. This release comes with new options for initialization of dynamic ROM models. Our users can choose the best strategy for initialization of the model during the evaluation phase of the reduced order model and the exported FMU. Mechanical Model ROM Previous model ROM apps have been unified in a single app. Users can now benefit from a simplified and automated workflow with less clicks. Finally, let's talk about Solver, Model Library, and User Experience. A new ModderCAD Thermal ROM component uses ModderCAD results to create a Thermal ROM model of the modder that can be integrated at system level simulation. Modelica Standard Library MSL 4.0 is supported in this release. Users can now load the Modelica Standard Library 4.0 in ANSYS Twin Builder and start composing Modelica models based on it. Get the best of ANSYS Digital Twin with ANSYS 2024 R2. Request your free trial.